Welcome to Genius Insight. It's very inspiring that you have been showing support to us by staying with us. Today, I'm going to introduce a very important issue to you which is communicable diseases. I will discuss the meaning of communicable diseases, their symptoms, types, treatment, and tips to prevent one from happening to you. As you will recall from the module on health education, advocacy, and community mobilization, health is defined as a complete state of physical, mental, and social well-being, and not the mere absence of disease. The term disease refers to a disturbance in the normal functioning of the body and is used interchangeably with illness. Diseases may be classified as communicable or non-communicable. Communicable, also known as infectious or transmissible, Diseases are caused by infectious agents that can be transmitted to other people from an infected person, animal, or a source in the environment. According to the World Health Organization, over 13 million people die each year from infectious and parasitic diseases. One in two deaths in some developing countries. Poor people, women, children, and the elderly are the most vulnerable. Infectious diseases continue to be the world's leading killer of young adults and children. Socioeconomic, environmental and behavioral factors, as well as international travel and migration, foster and increase the spread of communicable diseases. Vaccine-preventable, foodborne, zoonotic, healthcare-related and communicable diseases pose significant threats to human health and may sometimes threaten international health security. So, what are communicable diseases? How do these communicable diseases spread? What are the types and symptoms of infectious diseases? What are the common communicable diseases? How are infectious diseases treated? Can communicable diseases be prevented? If so, how? Well, in this video of Genius Insight, I will try my best to answer these questions and help you to take a look over the issue of communicable diseases, their symptoms, and how to avoid them. So, let's dive into the video. By the way, if you enjoy content like this, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and turn on notifications so you never miss a new video. What are communicable diseases? Communicable diseases can be caused by many pathogens, including bacteria, viruses, fungi, and parasites that may cause illness and disease. For humans, the transmission of pathogens may occur in a variety of ways spread from person to person by direct contact, water or foodborne illness, or aerosolization of infected particles in the environment and through insects, mosquitoes, and ticks. What are the symptoms of communicable diseases? Symptoms of communicable disease are particular to the type of disease. Here are a few symptoms of influenza include fever, chills, congestion, fatigue, muscle aches and headache. Other infectious diseases, such as Shigella, cause more serious symptoms, including bloody diarrhea, vomiting, fever, dehydration, shock. You may experience one or several symptoms of an infectious disease. It's important to see a doctor if you have any chronic symptoms or symptoms that get worse over time. What are the common communicable diseases? 1. Rhinoviruses Rhinoviruses are a group of viruses that are the most common trusted source cause of the common cold. Symptoms of a cold may include trusted source, a stuffy or runny nose, sore throat, headache. A person can catch a rhinovirus by inhaling contaminated droplets from the cough or sneezing of another person. 2. Coronaviruses Coronaviruses are a large group of viruses that affect the respiratory system trusted source. This family includes the SARS-CoV-2 virus. Some coronaviruses can cause the common cold and flu symptoms, while others can cause more severe outcomes. Treatments for communicable diseases. Treatment depends on which microorganism causes the infection. If bacteria cause disease, treatment with antibiotics usually kills the bacteria and ends the infection. Viral infections are usually treated with supportive therapies like rest and increased fluid intake. Sometimes people benefit from antiviral medications like oseltamivir phosphate. Doctors treat fungal and parasitic infections with antifungal medications like fluconazole and antiparasitic drugs such as mebendazole. 
In all cases, doctors treat specific symptoms of infectious diseases according to the latest medical guidelines. Talk with your doctor about your symptoms to explore possible treatment options. How can I prevent communicable diseases from spreading? You can do your part to prevent the spread of communicable diseases. For example, make sure your immunizations are up to date. Both children and adults need to be immunized at certain times. Wash your hands often. Know how to prepare food safely. Practice safer sex. Avoid contact with wildlife, such as feeding or petting wild animals. And make sure your pets stay healthy by getting them vaccinated by a vet. Not all infectious diseases are spread in the same way, and some are more infectious than others. And this is why I hope, by learning this information above mentioned you can take to reduce the risk of spreading disease and also help to prevent the spread of infectious disease. Please comment below if you have any views about the video content. Make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new video notification.